How's it going everybody, Gold Hat here and welcome back to the channel. This is going to be entry 71 of my Assassin's Creed Valhalla walkthrough guide and in this entry we are going to be focusing on all six codex pages. So this is a Ravensthorpe mission, a brief history of the Hidden Ones. I'm going to be covering this full mission along with all six locations for the codex pages, so let's go ahead and jump right in. Just a quick note, I will be breaking these down in the cities that they're in. I will also have timestamps down below in the description box in case you're just missing a few and you need to bounce around. But the order I'm doing these in so we don't have to just run around all over England. So let's go ahead and knock all these out. Survey the area, Sunan. Cast about this land, my friend. Thank you. 
see you, old friend. Do you see?
Go, my eyes. Aid me, be my eyes.
Now that we have gotten all six codex pages, we're going to go back to Ravensthorpe and hand these into Hytham, and that is going to be closing out this mission. Show me. Hytham, I have the Codex pages you asked for. Six in total. Ah, wonderful. We have so little writing from the original Hidden Ones. This will grow our understanding immeasurably. These documents may have been inked by the founders of the Hidden Ones, in fact. But their names are unknown to us. Lost to history. A deliberate choice on their part, I think. I'm hoping these documents shed some light on that mystery. I could not say. They're written in a language I do not understand. You know, the black market merchant Reda has an old piece of writing from the same era as the Codex pages you found. Speak with him if you are curious to see it. Greetings, Eivor. Always nice to see a friendly face. So if you see any about, send them my way. Reda. Hytham says you have an old piece of writing from the early Hidden Ones. Oh, that old scrap? Yes, it's just a short letter from one Hidden One to another. One of my rarest artifacts. How did it find its way to you? A friend gave it to me for safekeeping. Bayek was his name. Egyptian fellow. Very kind. Haven't seen him in a long time. A very long time. Anyway, the letter is written in Demotic. So it may not mean much to you, but you're free to have a look. A warning, my beloved. I have heard numerous tales now of a secret codex circulating among the acolytes of our bureaus, both within and without the Empire of Augustus, called the Magus Codex. It names you directly as one of the founders of the Hidden Ones. Apart from putting your life in danger, it flies in the face of what we have tried to achieve with our brotherhood. We are justice seekers who shun the light of praise for our good works and who must live in the shadows of our triumphs. Should you see any pages of this Codex, I advise you to destroy them. Keep the dream of our Hidden Ones alive. Now, I am not so naive to think this will be a simple task. Few men and women are suited to keeping such secrets for so long. And it may be that we will fail in the end, but we will have failed in the name of righteousness. Take care, my love. My Iset. My Northern Star. Even in my waning years, I am ever your Osiris. Let our Horus live on beyond us. I think of you often, my jewel. At sunrise and twilight. At new moon and full. When the rain falls and the breath of a moon rides across my neck. I remember you kissing me. Just there. And I will take that feeling to my tomb. And that will complete a brief history of the Hidden Ones quest, and that is going to be wrapping up Entry 71. As always, I hope this walkthrough guide has been super helpful. If it has been, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. If you have any questions at any time, feel free to drop a comment down below, or you can hit me up personally on my Instagram. The link is in the description box, and I'll see you guys next time. Gold Hat, signing off.